TCID50 preparation. After trypsinizing your cells, you are ready to prepare your 96 well tray for the TCID50. Have all your materials arranged neatly in the biohazard hood ready for use. By now your cells will have started to clump if left for a short while, so make sure to pipette them up and down to break up any cell clumps. Transfer this cell suspension to a sterile media tray. Set your multi-channel to 100 microliters and add cells to your tray column by column. Make sure to pipette up and down to keep breaking up cell clumps when necessary. You do not need to change tips between columns. Firstly, make sure you note the difference between a flat bottom and round bottom tray before you begin. You will be using the round bottom tray for your dilutions. After adding 270 microliters of growth media to the first two columns, except for wells A1 and B1, add 300 microliters of your diluted virus stock to these two empty wells. This will be serially diluted down the column as shown transferring 30 microliters two wells at a time using your multi-channel pipette. Remember to change tips between dilutions. Once your dilutions are complete, then add 25 microliters of each dilution into the corresponding well on your infected tray as shown. Leave the last two columns for virus free controls. Once complete, incubate your tray for six days. Stain your TCID50 tray in the biohazard hood. Add 100 microliters of methylene blue to each well as shown. You do not need to use a sterile tray for this.
Seal in a plastic bag overnight to avoid evaporation.